Okay, with this situation, you've got a bunch of charges all over the place. So you've got like positive, negative, positive, negative, positive, negative, all scattered everywhere. So what happens is when a cloud forms, it's like this good old fashioned cumulus. What happens is all the negative one, all the negative um, charges called electrons move down. They go down toward the bottom of the cloud. But from at the bottom of the cloud, they can't reach any any farther down. They get stuck and they start to compile. They're all angry. They're fighting each other. It's very unstable, right? Uh, unstable right here. Now, at the bottom, on the ground, the protons, on um, the um, positively charged um, particles, are right here, like on the trees and so forth. And what they want to do is they want to get up in the cloud, while the negative um, electrons want to get down. So what happens is they start reaching up and these guys are all angry, all crowded, and eventually, because it's so crowded at the bottom of the cloud, one finally pops out and starts zigzagging down. And when it connects with the proton, it creates a pathway in the air that allows all the other electrons to move down. And that equalizes the charges. Think of, um... Okay, let's just say that you've got this huge crowd of people right here. And right here, three donuts. Three donuts. You've got all these sprinkles, chocolate. Now, right here, these people want to get here. Bad. And, well, th these donuts want to get eaten. So they're trying to get each other, but right here is a wall. Now, if one of these people uh, finds a way to get around the wall, everybody's going to fall. This, what's, this is kind of what happens with lightning. you got all these electrons that want to get to the ground. If one finds a way, they all do. So, all down. And then, everybody's happy. 